In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a pop-up animation inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So the pop-up animation is really cool because it's really great to introduce graphics onto screen like a subscribe button, a like button, or any titles that you would like to feature. So once you've got Premiere Pro loaded up and you have your graphic ready to go, you want to select the graphic and go up to the Motion tab and we'll generate a new keyframe for scale. Move the cursor head back three frames and we'll change the value of this to 45. And then we'll go back another three frames and we'll change this to zero. So if we play this, you can see that the subscribe button bounces onto the screen and lands back into its final place, which is really cool. And that is basically the pop-up effect complete. But if you wanted to add some more bounce, then we would need to add some more keyframes. So after that third keyframe, we'll scroll across three frames, create a brand new keyframe, and we'll do that one more time. And then we'll go into the third keyframe, change the value of this to 25. And we'll go into the fourth keyframe and change the value of this to 38. And now if we play this back, you'll see there is a little bit more bounce to this animation, but if you don't wanna add that much bounce, then all you would need to do is delete those last two keyframes and then if we wanted to animate this out in the similar style, all we would need to do is create a brand new keyframe on the current scale, scroll across three or four frames and pull this down to zero. And then there you go, that would just quickly snap out of the frame. And there you go, that is how you do the pop-up animation inside of Adobe Premiere Pro using keyframes. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell icon, and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. See you there.